Hi, Sarah here. I'm doing another product review for you today on the Axon Care um, digital thermometer. I came across this recently. My son was sick and he had a double ear infection. And um, up to this point, he is not even two. We've been using an ear thermometer for him. Um, but even when he was in the NICU and we would take his temperature a couple of times a day, He's always hated having his temperature taken. In the NICU, we would take it under his arm. Um, that's what Stanford Hospital said was okay for us to do. And um, they did that while he was there at Stanford. And um, so my husband and I were racking our brains, you know, what's an easier way? Because normally, even when he doesn't have an ear infection, it's hard to take his temperature in his ear. We also have one of the basal the thermometers where you can rub it over his head. That's difficult as well. He just won't work with us. Um, so we're like, you know, let's just do what we did in the NICU. Let's do it under his arm. So we did that with, you know, the NICU sent us home with a couple of thermometers um, because we had a t hard time keeping um, my son's temperature up when he was first born. Um, so we had to have him under heat lamps and to, you know, keep his temperature up, and, um, we did that for a few weeks, and, um, so the NICU did send us home with a bunch of thermometers, and they do take a minute, they took, like, 60 seconds, um, maybe a little longer, I, I never really timed it, um, but it's like, you know, this is just taking so long, and so he, of course, got better, um, in about a week, he was pretty sick for a while, and um, when I came across this one, I, I saw, it was like, it takes the temperature in 10 seconds. I was like, wow, 10 seconds. Um, I think I can get him to, like, if nothing else, I can hold him still for 10 seconds. 10 seconds is about the max. Um, so I decided, you know, go ahead and try it. So when you turn it on, turn it on, on here, it's very easy to read and it automatically goes to 98.6 pretty quickly and then um and it says 97.1 and it took 10 seconds I'm just going to do it again see if it stays that way And this time it said 97.8. So just, you know, out of curiosity's sake, one more time. And it goes back 97.1. So... I feel like this is a fairly accurate um, when I compare it to our um, ear thermometer. It's been about the same temperature as this one. So the nice thing I like about this one, you know, it just went back to 97.1 even though the first time it went up a few um, decibels. But it wasn't like a whole degree. When you're l looking at a young kid, those degrees make sense, you know, they're very important. 102 is going to be a lot different than 103, um, and they can become, you know, 103 is much different than 104. At 104, you need to start worrying, um, according to, you know, the specialists that we see and everything. So, I like this thermometer. It works really quickly. Um, we were able to put it under his arm. I was able to hold him for 10 seconds and let it do its work. Um, because it does it so quickly. You know, and you're, it's easy to read. I know this is backwards on the monitor, but 97.4, so, you know, it's staying within that 97 range, um, which is pretty accurate for my temperature. 
I used to stay roughly around 97 something, um, and I'm kind of cold right now, so 97.4, just 0.2 above. Very, very close, um, so I feel like this is accurate. This is a soft, bendy silicone, which is nice. This part right here comes off, but it's not, not very easy to get off. I had to work at it earlier when I tried to take it off, um, but you can take it off and this is where the battery goes and you're able to just you know kind of pop it out if you don't have fingernails like I do you can use like a bobby pin or you know even a small knife like a butter knife would work um, so that's where that is and you just put it right back on here like that but see it doesn't come off easily um, Silicone, the button right here is silicone as well. Um, it's a soft button. And this is hard plastic. This is hard plastic. But when you get in here, this is not. This is, you know, nice soft silicone. And then the tip is metal, of course. It does come with a carrying case, which I found really nice because in between uses, I can put it in here. And it's going to, you know stay nice and clean for us. If you want to turn it off if it doesn't, most of the time it goes off by itself, but you can always press the button again and it'll go off. Um, nice storage case. I was given this um, product at a reduced rate in order for my honest review and opinion. Um, typically it runs around $19.99, which is going to be more expensive than you're going to find with, say, like a VIX thermometer like this, which is around $12. Bucks. Um, so it is a few dollars more, but overall I really like it and I'm very pleased with the quality and the precision of this product. Um, if you're like me and you have a toddler that's not going to sit still and let you take their temperature, then this is a great product. And if you know, you're fighting ear aches, they aren't going to want their temperature taken in their ear even if they like having their temperature taken and they, they work with you it's going to hurt their ear so this is another um, good alternative for that so um, I'm very fortunate that we were able to try this out um, and we got it when we weren't sick um, so that it wasn't like urgent to make sure it worked etc um, but it does work it works very well for us and it's worth the price and the cost so um, five out of five stars an extra bonus point because of the case not all thermometers come with cases so you know this is really nice when we put it in our first aid kit um, so we're very impressed with vacuum care and I'm very glad that we got this thermometer and I'm very happy for the accuracy and it was able to work for my son I did try it under his armpit and um, he did squirm for a minute but because it was so quick it didn't make much of a difference and it made it much less of a headache and there were far fewer tears shed when I was trying to take his temperature. Um, it's usually a whole like just ordeal. He's normally crying. Even under his armpit he's like crying. You just think like you did the worst thing to him ever. Um, with this I was it didn't feel like that. He didn't really know what was going on um, and it happened so quickly he wasn't able to register oh they're taking my temperature. Didn't know. So um you know, definitely appreciated that and its accuracy in the four or five temperatures I took with you just online now. It went from 97.1 to 97.8, a seven temperature, uh, actually six decibel temperature difference. Um, it says accuracy within 0.2. I'd say it's within 0.6, um, but it is very, fairly accurate. Um, so I do appreciate that. I hope this review was um, thorough and accurate for you and that I was able to help answer any of the questions that you may have had on whether or not this is a product that you should get and if it's worth the price. Um, we enjoyed it and we're glad we have it. So, thank you.